Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Chance Davis Road to the Show Series, Episode 20. I uh, missed an episode yesterday. Oh, we had a doubleheader the day before. We'll count that. Um, but I did get something important. So we got a Diamond Ball Player um, pack for just playing the game. Uh, for th a thank you from San Diego Studios to compensate for the ball player problems we've been having. And we got lucky, I think. And we got a Velo Diamond Perk. So we have a plus eight to Velo. I added that on top of my silver Velo. So now our control and home runs per nine are a little down, but our hits per nine are an 83, uh, and our Velo is at an 89. And what our program, we got a 62 right now. We're gonna get three definitely, maybe five today. Uh, still 24 away. But the main thing is our Velo is so high now. When we look at our uh, whatever, get our ball player card. If you look up in the top right, our sinker is now an average 92, and our fastball is an average 97. We are going to be throwing some heat now. I'm so excited. New perk. Um, we are at, going to be pitching next on, looks like, ooh, September 3rd versus the Sugarland Bees or Wasps or something. Um, and Forrest Whitley, who has a good bit of potential. Carlos, you played in AAA on your way to the majors, and I gotta think, as a fan, it's gotta be so exciting being right on the doorstep, knowing that one big performance could elevate you to the show. Now, ben, you're absolutely right. You know that you are just a step below the major leagues, and that if you perform, you will get the call, but that could add pressure to you, so you have to be very careful as a player and you have to keep your emotions in check and still think about the process and not get too far ahead of yourself. That that was one right. of the keys for me. Just stay in the present. Everything else will take care of itself. Well said, I guess. Thanks, Carlos Pina. We go to, into our bullpen day. It is a 65 overall. Could work on some break. We really need to work on control. We had the change up control there. Sinker velocity, not very necessary right now. I think I'm going to go with sinker control and change up control. I think that could really help. Skip the training. We do not care a bit. In the minor leagues, a lost season is All categories are boosted by two for this game. We're facing off against Josh James instead, who is also very good. This must be, I guess, the Astros? Or is Josh James even still with the Astros? We're 4 1 with 49 innings pitched and 35 strikeouts with a 3.12 ERA here in AAA. Let's hope we have a good start like we did last time. Cheese is our um, archetype. And we have. A plus 10% to control and a minus 12% confidence drain. Thank goodness for... Oh, voice cut. Thank goodness for our friendships with our catcher. That is why we have that. Um, this is once again to get to 500. We keep getting put in this situation. Let's do it this time, boys. I like that shout of Tucker Davidson. And teammates and whatnot. James on the mound for the bees today will turn down our game volume a little more let's ball out today chance let's really have a good September here in AAA we're not gonna get anything going and here we go Jordan Brewer steps up to the plate we've never played the Skeeters and we are throwing a lot harder now this is 90 to 95 now a 93 hit hard into right, but caught out there for our first out. That was almost a huge L. <laughs> first pitch, and it gets crushed. Frutus Nova steps up. Bad pulse. Got to get those timings down. Fouled off. 
The offensive game plan today is certainly to see the ball up. This guy is known on the mound for sinker change. That's popped up. Should be played. And there's two down now. Alberto Ibarra. Turn game sound up a little bit. I'm trying to really find a good mix. Right there is perfect. Good change up, strike one. Now we're going to attack his hot zone here. Keep it low, though. Good pitch. Yes, sir. Okay, 0 2. Could use a strike out here with this change up chance. Good pitch. But it'll take. Formulate a game plan. Ibarra has a great batting average. One and one to start the road trip, and you're moving in the right direction. One two. And a Way low. In the dirt as he lays off it for a two two. Don't be surprised if he gets another back foot slider right here. How about the fastball? Just because he took the first one. He takes it. Should have been a strike three. Ninety-seven miles per hour. Get a full count. Into the windup. Ready. Change up on the full count. Fouled it off. We'll go fastball here. Popped in the center. Will he get there? It's a long run. He's going to get there. Three up, three down for chance. Enjoying that added velocity, and he's finally throwing his hardest. Well, not his hardest. He's going to be throwing like. 99. 102, possibly. Stepping up is Colton Shaver, and he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. Just outside with the sinker. Quite a bit off the plate that time. How about the changeup? Good pitch. Stick changeup here. Ball, even at 1-1 and fouled off. Foul right side. Late on that, so what's he going to do about the fastball? Alright, put it in the strike zone, Chance. He got around on it. I like that call. Let's try it, Chance. Slider inside. Pull two inside. So 2-2 two, two count. About a sinker running off the plate. Got him to swing at it, and that will finish that road to the show mission. First K of the day for Chance. And there's three more program points added. Even if you do get the bat on the ball, there's not a whole lot you could do with that. Textbook sinker. To the plate now, Taylor Jones. One down. Right down the middle, strike one. He comes in at 262 on the year. Nine homers, 53 RBIs. It's going to be a little more aggressive after taking that one. And he chased it. Wow. Every time you to start a game on the mound, you hope to settle in quickly and get into a groove, and he's definitely done that so far. Hey, don't put in the strikes on here. Well, four outs in. Let's not say that yet, sir. Good changeup spot. Doesn't chase because it was way out. Up top for a fastball. And we blow it by him. That's that 97 mile per hour power. Yes, sir. He's way late. And I really like that pitch now. Good change up, strike one. He'll come in with an average down at 230, six home runs, and 37 RBIs. Slider inside. That's hit well into right, but it'll be caught. And that'll end the inning. So we go into the third. All tied at zero with our 8 9 1 duo. And we are tied, nothing, nothing. And a couple on, but we will score one. Okay, nice. RERA right at three. He'll 
get us going in the home half of inning number three. So we enter the third here. And that misses low. here, but that sinks a bit too much that time. It's one and oh. I love everything this pitcher's got work. I like the idea, but that was a bad pulse. He's got great body language. But a good pitch when we get the call. Command and a nice early feel for one one speed stuff. From the windup, the one one pitch. Change incoming. Bad pitch. Ooh, speared by chance. He gets it to first. One down. Lorenzo Quintana steps up. Quintana, my bad. Good pitch. Got him to swing through it. Good timing on that, so we'll go fast ball up top. And he's on us in timing, but doesn't get a great piece of the ball and pops out to center field. Alright, Jake Myers. Good change up on the outside part of the plate. We'll put the sinker out there now. And he did go, so 2 Way early, too. How about the change up here, 0 2 Good pitch, and we'll take that for a third strikeout. 1 2 3 again for the. What are they called? Sugar something. Seethers? I don't know. <laughs> We will not get anything else. They are the Skeeters. <laughs> back to the top of the lineup here in the fourth. Brewer steps back up to the plate. And this is where the frustration can start setting in on a team if they're not careful. It's never a good feeling when off right down the middle. They're on the mound is completely shutting you down. Never go up and out with the fastball. Let's do it. Fouled off. Fouled it off. Oh, two. Got him where we want him. There's another pitch for a strike, and this guy's really attacking hitters well tonight, being aggressive. O2, fast or slider here. Like he is, Didn't he get have a pretty good night. Um, the release we wanted. Into the How about the changeup? On the ground will be played by, I believe, it's not, is that Marcus Brito? I can't tell. No, it is not. Played by our second baseman, though. Get the out. He flew out last time. Let's give him a sinker. Right down the middle. Played by our third baseman. And that will be the second out of the fourth. Albert Ibarra steps up. Alberto, my bad. Good fastball, don't get the call. Like a strike, but let me tell you, when you're staring at a big zero in the hit column, getting a call like that to go your way feel like a big victory. On the ground. He's got it. Play thrown to first and three. Up three down once again for the Skeeters. Chance feeling good today as we still lead 1-0 heading in the into the fifth. Solo shot for Logan Davidson. Is it Logan? I think. I think I've been calling him Tucker every now and then. Yeah, I definitely have. It's Logan. 3 nothing. Las Vegas. Going for the backdoor slider. Not a good spot, and that will be the Skeeters. First hit of the day. Chance had a no-hitter through four. But a good piece of hitting finally gets them in the hit column. Bad pulse. Strike one. Hey, let's not fall apart now. Deep center. Bad jump on it. He gets there. Thank you, sir. Wow. That ball was jacked, but luckily our guy on center made a great play on the ball. Now let's be a little smarter. Up 
fouled, away. fouled off. And 98. Still early. So the changeup will not work. He turns on it. About the slider. He swings, it's popped up, and it will get down. So one out hit. We've got two on. He needs to put that on the mantle. He's been struggling. The season hasn't gone according to plan. But he's staying pot committed and grind it out a nice night. It's a good pitch, too. Just better hitting. Couple hits for the Skeeters this inning. We'll get the sinker call. Much needed. Fastball. Blown by him. Great job by the pitcher right Change up. Fouled it off. Dang, I thought that would get him. O2. Slider. Uh. Run the sinker out. 2-2. Two, two. Missed it. Come on. Early on that. Could use a strikeout. That's big chance. Let's go. <laughs> big strikeout there. We've got two down now. Lorenzo Quintana steps up and will take the changeup for strike one. And we'll see what he can do here with a pair of runners on base and two gone here in the fifth. Going sinker. Fouled off. 0-2. Oh, right How about one more strikeout chance on the ground? Should be played. And that will get us out of the fifth. Got a little bit of trouble there, but nothing scored. Threw five chances playing phenomenal today. We'll see what we can do in the sixth. We will two two more come around to score. We're up five nothing. Jake Myers steps up. We will get to pitch the sixth. Down the line. Trouble. Jake can run. Get it in so he doesn't get three. He will not. But a leadoff double does spell some trouble for us. Out of the nine hole hitter. Fastball. Strike one. But it's a good one. Jordan Brewer is in for the third time now as he Way takes early. a called strike. It's 0-1. Change up. Well placed, but he got a piece. Strikes went out of the zone that time, but he stays alive. Fastball. Softly got a piece, and it's speared by the third baseman. Nice. One down. Nova steps up for his third of bat. He's 0 for 2. We don't get the first pitch strike there. Don't get that call. Popped it up into straightaway center. This could be close to third if he decides to go. He will not. I got it. <laughs> Alberto Ibarra steps up 0 for 2. Sinker misses inside. Changeup hits the corner. Strike one. We'll go into his hot spot. I'm not sure it's wise, but we'll do it. Fouled it off. Okay. Got him where we want him. 0-2. How about an inside slider? Good pitch. We got the ground. Tuck Logan! Unbelievable. We're going to get him a second, but that's an error, right? One scores, and it will be counted as an error, so that will not be an earned run. Wow. What a bad play. That's short. 
Striding in is so is that our earned run? Let's get a box score there. It is an earned run. Wow. Ooh, tough. Pulse. On the ground, we'll get that easily. One down. But you have to give credit to where it's deserved. The pitching on the other side has been really impressive. Taylor Jones will step up. Now is the designated hitter. Taylor Jones. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. So we're responsible for the first guy, but we're not responsible for the guy that got. That if he would have stayed at first, we would not have been responsible for him. Straight away center, and they're keeping our pitch count down. I don't mind. Maybe we'll get to throw a seventh. Next to hit, CJ Inahosa, one for two in the ball game thus far. Fastball, right down the middle, strike one. He'll take that first pitch strike all day long. If they're going to take 0 0, he's going to pound that zone and get it. 0 1. Much more susceptible Fouled to 0 1 than 1 0. What was his timing on that early? Let's go change up. And Fouled it off. He stayed back on that pretty well. Seventh inning here in a 5 to 1 ball game. Fastball up top. And it's fouled away. He got a mistake and right peace. there, but missed it. Can't foul that pitch off in a big spot. 0-2 count. Heater caught too much of the Let's zone. Let's see the change up. Ah. Away with that one. It's one and two. Waste pitch there. You know what? Give this guy some credit up there because bad pulse. Come on. Very quick inning. He's been able Nearly to hit him. This at bat out a little bit, and that's something that shouldn't go unnoticed. The two-two. Let's see the sinker chance. Ooh, caught a lot of zone, but he got under it. So he'll pop it up, and Davidson will make the play on this one. Three up, three down. Still up four. Let's see if they let us throw the eighth. Please do. They will not let us throw the eighth. So, Ooh. yep, gets out of it. Nice. We added a little bit of insurance, but it was not needed as we end up winning this one 6 2 1. And there is Chance Davis's fifth win of the season. Yes, sir. Love to see it. Old Tucker, or not Tucker, Logan Davidson and I will be moving up to MLB level soon together. I'm excited to see where we go, but we went with seven innings pitched, no walks and three hits, giving up one earned run, beating Josh James, and striking out for Logan had a big day at the plate, even though he made an error. He made up for it with his bat. Three RBIs, including a homer. And I believe it, that was a solo shot. He was three for five on the day. Really good day for the Aviators as we move to 500 on the season. Looking to, of course, end strong. Adding some oof, ball player stuff. Uh, we got four more strikeouts added to that 80 strikeout deal so we need 20 more to complete that we should get that by the end of the season i have to imagine tons of boosts wow all three breaks go up we don't have a four seam break uh fastball velo goes up walks per nine goes up home runs per nine goes up in our fielding uh really didn't go up that much but yeah we're making a lot of good progress here uh, these are all base attributes, obviously, um, if you didn't know. Like, once we get to 50, we can't go up any higher than that. That's all based on our archetype. That's how that works. And we are now a 66 overall. Great to see. Let's look in the grand scheme of things where we stand with the A's. Uh, all right, so five here. We are the ninth ranked pitcher right now in the organization. Uh, so we might get a spring training bid in this upcoming season. And one more up and we'll be Bracewell, who's not going to get any better. But Lazardo, Tanaka, and Chance are most definitely the future of this rotation. And uh, I'm excited for that, of course. 
Let's look at our shortstop, which is Tucker. Or, gosh, his name is Logan. Logan. Logan, Logan, Logan. Logan Davidson. All right. <laughs> He's our future at a shortstop. I'm super excited to see what he can do. Um, then you've got Ramon Laureano out in center. Lots of, lots of potential in center field. Matt Chapman is a stud. I love Matt Chapman, one of my favorite players in the MLB. He's going to be great. He's, he's already great. He'll stay around that 90 overall region for a while. We've got Marcus Brito, uh, it's an A potential second baseman who plays shortstop too. Not a great hitter, more of a fielder, but he's got a ton of potential. And so does Preston Weber all the way down here. Uh, even though he's a 56, still a potential, and that's more than a lot of people can say. Uh, Sean Murphy, he's 26, 82 overall, a potential great um, looking catcher there. And then we've got Eric Ramirez, a 65 overall, 20 year, 20 year old, a potential. Uh, I mean, we've got this team has potential. It could be really good one day. Uh, it just comes down to if we are, <laughs> uh, if we max, if we really give it our all and become a good team. Let's check out. Those Royals and Cam Jackson still not having a good year. And then we've got Adam Turner is now 92 overall. 264, 12 homers, 51 RBIs, and 41 steals on the air with an OPS of what? 742, not bad for a rookie. Will he be a rookie of the year? Most certainly not. That's going to none other than Max Hamilton, who is 12 and 7 with two. Ooh, wow, 200 strikeouts and a 2.52 ERA, 98 overall over in Toronto. How many of his starts have been quality starts? 20 of his 27 starts. That's pretty good numbers right there. And his FIP is a 2.61. He is a phenomenal pitcher. It'll be interesting to see Max versus Chance, who is the better pitcher uh, in the long run. I don't know. It's tough to beat Max. Um, he's off to a great start. Going to win that Rookie of the Year. But we'll call our episode right here. If you like the episode, hit a like. Hit the like button on the episode on the video and subscribe to the channel for more. We post one of these every day at noon Eastern time. Um, but yeah, that's it for me. That is Chance Davis, episode twenty in the books.